KUAM News Storm Tracker Updates, presented by McDonald's of Guam, Pacific Solar, Atkins Kroll, Calvo's Insurance, and Docomo Pacific. Hoffa Day, I'm Jolene Tovis, and I'm here at Boat Basin, where you, we can already feel the effects of Typhoon Dolphin. Even though its closest point of approach isn't until 6 p.m. this evening, you, as you can see, we're already feeling strong winds, rain, and with it, treacherous waters. Now, these waters are so strong and treacherous that even the most skilled swimmer will succumb to its power. So you got to remember to stay out of the water. Do not try to go swimming or doing any boating activities as it is extremely dangerous. Also, during condition of readiness, one, all residents are advised to stay in their homes and do not travel on any of the roadways as the roads are meant for emergency personnel vehicles during condition of readiness one. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Jolene Tovis, so stay tuned to the stations of KYM for the latest updates on Typhoon Dolphin. KUAM News Storm Tracker Updates, presented by McDonald's of Guam, Pacific Solar, Atkins Kroll, Calvo's Insurance, and Docomo Pacific.